Hey guys, this is Devin at the Ryukin Pro Shop. I'm going to show you how to skirt up a lure today. Let's get started. Alright, so step one, we'll start off with the, the skirts off the shelf. We'll pick out the color combination we want. We want an outside and an inside skirt. Um, won't be using these, but for example, this is how they come right off the shelf, tag, still head on. Once we pick out the colors we want, we'll go ahead and what I'll do is I'll start with the inside skirt and I will just, I'll line this inside skirt up with the bottom of the saddle here. So this lure's got what we call the saddles here. They drop in and then on the skirt themselves, we call that the neck. So we want that neck right at the base and lined up just with the top of that saddle. And that'll keep us from getting too many bulges or something when we go ahead and finish up this lure. So we'll start with the inside skirt. And what I'll do is once I get that nice and lined up and I'll see where I want to cut it, I'll cut it. And I'll sit there and flip this inside out. Just like that. Kind of hold it like a cup. Grab something something to lube it up, give it a quick little spray, take your lure, straight in the top of that cup, just get it in. You'll see it naturally falls into that saddle right where that neck of the skirt's real tight. It'll just fall and sit right in there. Once we get that, we'll grab some rigging floss. I like to grab it up two feet or so, so I got enough to pull on. And we'll see what I mean here in a second. I hold that lure up with the hook stop facing out. This black piece is a hook stop. All the black bark lures uh, will come with that. Um, you can always replace them too. We sell those in the shop as well. But you'll go ahead and take that rigging floss and what I'll do is make a little U just like that, and I'll hold it down with my thumb. And I'll take the, the longer piece, you got my short tag in, and the main piece, I'll go ahead and cross over that U. Just like that. And I wrap it a couple of times, and I pull it nice and tight. I'll wrap it a couple more times, pull it nice and tight. And I open up that loop we made at the beginning, and I feed that main piece through that hole. Kind of get it snug. And pull that tiny tag piece from the beginning. And that'll get everything nice and snugged up. Once we get it there, we just want to cut the little trims off. Leave a little bit so you can pull, pull this if needed to replace your skirts. Flip your skirt back down, just like so. You'll see that first that first skirt's on there. Inside skirt's done. Now we'll move on to the top skirt, the outer skirt. We'll do the same exact thing. We'll take it right off the shelf. I'll line it up, I'll see where I wanna cut it, and I'll go and cut that, just like that. Do the same exact thing. Flip it inside out. Give it a cup. Spray it, and I get that bottom skirt through, best you can, it takes a second, just to get everything lined up. You'll get it to fall straight through. And then I'll grab that bottom skirt there, just like this, and I'll go ahead and pull the rest of that skirt up. Just like that. And you'll see it naturally falls into that saddle we were talking about earlier. Grab some more rigging floss. Do the same exact step you did on the last one. Make that U we were talking about. Hold it down. Cross over. Give it a couple of wraps. Pull it nice and tight, cinch everything together. A couple 
couple more wraps. Pull it tight. And we'll feed it straight through that hole we made at the beginning. Snug it up. Pull that tag piece tight. Get everything nice and smooth. Cut that excess off. And I just leave just enough to pinch if I need to take this off. Um, we didn't tie a knot or anything, so if I pull this real real hard, all of it will just unravel itself. That's how we can change them out on the boats when we need to. If a wahoo tears your skirt up and you got the stuff to replace it on the boat, you can do that on the go. Um, that's why we like these lures and the way we set them up is just ideal. Once you finish that up, you'll flip it back out. Get what we call the lateral lines of the skirts. Um, lined up with the lure itself you can you can tell the top from the bottom uh, the logo here's the dead giveaway on that so we got the top of the lure and the bottom you want the dark side up light side on bottom um, just like a fish so line that up both sides so what we'll do now is we'll take the lure itself measure from the top of the, the lure to the bottom of the skirt there and we'll trim the excess we need. Let's say this lure's recommendation is 14 and a half inches, for example. I'll sit there and I'll grab it at 14 and a half. And I'll cut off that excess. I'll usually cut it off at a little, at a V point. Just like that. Get it all lined up just like that and that is how you skirt up a black bart lure